Today in the Engine Power Shop, we are going to be modifying the header for our Ford 300 for individual auction sensors and EGTs. So the first step is to drill a bunch of holes in our header. We're drilling 7 8 holes for the O2 bungs and 5 16 for the EGTs. In the lathe, we're going to take the O2 sensors and the EGTs and put a small step on them. This gives a little register when we put it inside the hole, makes it easier to get in place and stay there. And we'll go through and tack each one individually. That way they are all set in position. We can make sure we can get to all of them and everything. This will make sure that everything's in this right spot before we weld them in fully. So we're doing this with our 40 220 TIG welder and some ERS 70-2 filler wire. We're just gonna go through and make sure that everything is fully welded. It doesn't necessarily have to be perfect because it's a dyno header, but we do want it to look good and seal effectively. The hardest part really is getting in all the nooks and crannies to make sure that everything is fully welded. And then we will go through and tap the threads on every single bung. And there we have it. Now we can read air fuel ratio and exhaust gas temperature in each cylinder individually and correct it with our EFI system when we get our Ford 300 on the dyno.